going through the roof. That's outrageous. I mean, it, I mean, and I mean, a guy that comes into my cigar lounge, he can't he can't drive Uber anymore, and they they won't let him because they said he's he's got medical issues and you know his feet, so he doesn't have a way to make money. Yeah, and he and he's been begging everybody for money. Everybody, they're asking, they're asking everybody for money. And I say, he said, hey, Ty, did you get hit up? I said, no, hit up for what? Said, you know, so-and-so uh, wants money. And I was like, what? No, I don't have any money for him. And, you know. and he says, well, he's going to be homeless. So, well, he better get a tent. But I don't want to tell him. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't, don't want to tell him. I mean, you know, I mean it's, it's bad. Money, what are you, man? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's like how much, I mean, and, and there's nothing we do. But it's growing. I mean, I think the, the whole con- the consumer thing, I, I think that, the homelessness. We have so many issues that are being, and then the suicide rate goes up. I mean, because people say, "I," and I didn't share this with you guys, but another, I lost another guy at my job. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, this guy in Napoli, I, I worked with for many years, and I just found out two nights ago he committed suicide, and he was, worked his way all the way up to director, and I get a text. And you don't yeah. ever want to get that text, and it just blows you away. And just it's when you were talking about suicide, I forgot about him, but he. I just just was happened. it his gun? For Did he shoot himself? Yeah. No. yeah, I'm so sorry. Yeah, yeah, I, I was just and he, you know, here he is, got family, and uh, and I did find out years ago that his mom had also had killed herself. Ugh. Yeah, so. well, yeah, that's uh, like, yeah. and yeah, so, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. and it's a, it, I'm so, it's, sorry, it's it a downer, is. but I mean, it's, it, yeah, but <laughs> yeah. I'm just, I mean, just thinking about just, that yeah. and people doing well and people trying to live their lives with all this going on on in our different societies that it's it's causing yeah. a problem and you got this guy sitting in office saying whatever yeah yeah and I mean will, yeah. no. he will never kill himself that's the sad thing ever ever no, ever he, and in fact no, he thinks he will never die no but they could make it look die. like a suicide <laughs> yeah the Russians could yeah <laughs> he might want to think about killing himself when he's in jail for the rest of his life they said uh, Hitler tried did, did Hitler really kill himself yeah did someone, yeah did it's pretty did. well confirmed uh, okay yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Jim Coughlin one of the stars of too many Hitlers ah yeah. yes an expert yeah. then yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've been watching. There's a new Netflix show about the his circle. Huh. Very interesting. Yeah. Anyway, the, uh, is it called The Crown? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a it's about uh, you know Goebbels and Goring and yeah. uh, you know and Hitler and, and bears. Oh my! <laughs> uh, uh, it's yeah, just could resist. Could. No. <laughs> It's uh, it's like the scene in Roger Rabbit when you know they're they're looking for Roger and they're going around the bar, waiting. Yeah, for him and, and he can't oh, resist. Bitch. Yeah, yeah. It's you, you <laughs> give me that opening. It's yeah. like come on, really? Wow. Uh, well, on that happy note, uh, we do want to thank everyone for listening. I want to thank everyone for coming in and being on the panel this week. It, it's like a family reunion. Yeah. It, was, it was wonderful to see you guys and, and yell about the world with you. Um, so much fun. Before we get out of here, uh, Timon, you got anything going on this uh, week? No, I do not, actually. Just um, working. All right. Well, <laughs> but people can find you on the uh, social media. Social media at the, uh, what is it, uh, Twitter, Time and Ship, and Facebook at Time and Ship. Yeah. There we go. Erica Schickel, thank you for coming in. Uh, so anything in the here. hopper? Uh, where can uh, people you know, find you? I'm just finishing a book right now, and I'll keep you guys posted on that. And uh, meanwhile, you am shickety at Twitter, and uh, it's just so much fun to be back with you guys. Yay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mr. Jim Coughlin. Yeah. Uh, M-R-J-I-M-C-O-U-G-H-L-I-N at, well, at in the front there. <laughs> Twitter. Twitter at. Anyway. Uh, hosting of the Ice House uh, Stage Two on the twenty fifth of March. Yes, and so that's actually, up. and actually, a Monday I'll be at Barney's Beanery doing oh, nice. comedy. I won't uh, just be there. Not just oh, that out. night show that they have up there. Yeah, Pasadena. Pasadena. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a good fun. show. I don't know sad. who's running it, but uh, yeah. I did it once. Yeah, it's cool. Good show. Awesome. Uh, and I am Dr. David Robinson. You can find me on the Twitter at Stand Up Fall Down, and you can find this show on Facebook at let's or you know facebook.com slash let's be treasonable and on twitter at let's be treasonable minus two e's because we're passing the savings on to you that's l-e-t-s-b-t-r-e-a-s-o-n-a-b-l cover your left eye and read the next line down i want to thank you for listening if you like the show please tell everybody if you didn't keep it to yourself we'll be back next week hopefully you will too until then goodbye